what's going on cats and chicks urchin greaser here and yeah i've got a lot to talk about um got the, uh, the greaser community to talk about uh, the gtfo movement there's been some like moments about it but uh, it's all been like done and dusted so i thought i'd uh, explain about it it's kind of funny in a way and uh, also uh, this uh, lounge what's well, been like uh, done like recently on um, instagram so yeah let's begin nice cup of coffee down the hatch Very nice, very nice indeed. So yeah, um, with the greaser community, uh, a lot of people make assumptions like saying, uh, is it like a Facebook like group page or um, on Instagram or any other like social media and whatnot? Not necessarily, but in kind of like in a fury, um, if we didn't have like YouTube or uh, Facebook or Instagram and whatnot. Uh, to be quite frank, um, we wouldn't have known like anyone like um, Outlaw Greaser or uh, Madman and uh, Rock and Roll Joker. Uh, quite frankly, I can go on like of all like the greasers, the greaser chicks, the pinups and whatnot. And for you guys like watching the video, uh, you guys know who you are, and I know who you guys are. So I thought I'd cover it like that. But anyway, um, aside all that. The greeter community is basically a reality. It's literally like outside. And uh, the view for that is uh, because like the greeter community is like reality and outside, uh, this is like your opportunity like to uh, like show the world that uh, the greasers are still around. Uh, we're not like underground or anything like that. So therefore, uh, if you know anyone uh, who's into the greaser lifestyle, like from around the area, or like a couple of like miles away or whatever, like people you know in your country and they're into the Greaser lifestyle, why not give them a call and like hook up with like one another and uh, bond with one another and uh, just walk around like in your leather jackets and stuff like that. It's down to you guys of what to do really. Uh, I can't say what you do and what not because I don't know what's there but perhaps there's an example like play a game of pool or uh, Perhaps like look out for any like venues like going on car shows and whatnot. That's pretty much more of a bonus if there's like um, venues like going on and that way um, gives you like the opportunity to um, attract like more attention as well. And you never know, man, you might come across um, the original guys who are like greasers like back in their day and stuff like that. Anything can happen, man. So it's all down to you guys. So therefore, you know what to do, so get out there and um, you guys know what to do. Okay, so before I get into the, um, the GTFO movement, uh, I want to make things clear that uh, the controversial like, drama which went on with uh, Stray Cat Reason and all that, uh, that's all been straightened out. Uh, everything's all cool and it's all like drama free. It's all done and dusted. So yeah, um, <clears throat> with the GTFO movement, uh, no one's in charge of it. Uh, no one's like corner shots or corner strings and all that. The GTFO movement is basically like down to um, us uh, individuals. Like from where I just uh, pointed out with the greaser community, it's basically like a similarity to that. So originally there was the whole like, uh, don't uh, like steal my word, do like another word and stuff like that. There was, but like I just said um, earlier in this um, topic, everything's all done and dusted. Uh, Everything's all for like quits and uh, there's no more like beef or anything like that. Um, Stray Cat basically like um, like giving himself up, but <clears throat> in a civilized like kind of way. So for all the people out there, uh, just let it go, man, um, and just uh, continuing like greasing out. It's all there is to it. Um, originally, um, Stray Cat Greaser, um, he did like the cigar lounge uh, before he uh, flew solo, like due to like uh, various reasons which I won't like talk about. <clears throat> so, um, however, though, uh, to make it fair, like for the cats who don't like smoke and all that, uh, crash, <laughs> done like a, a lounge. <clears throat> I went on there not long ago and it was pretty cool. Uh, I didn't expect that name, but fair enough. Uh, the name of Crash thought of was basically uh, the Pomade Lounge. I don't know if complaints of that, man. And Straight Cat, if you're watching the video, man. Um, you are welcome like, to um, come back. I hope things are all good with you, man. And um, yeah, I thought I'd finish it from here. And of course, um, Stay Greasy Cats and GTFO.